what we've been really trying to do for all of the Fedora desktop for a long time is really improve the user experience. And Fedora is a real a place where a lot of different components and development pieces come together into a compelling product in the end. And we've been really trying to fill in some of these gaps. And in particular, one of them is the in the graphics and free video drivers. When you boot Fedora, you'll see actually a splash screen where before you'd only see like a very basic um, effect. And we now have like a much nicer transition. So as soon as you turn on Fedora, you'll see a nice animated logo and then it'll go to the login screen. After you've logged in, um, a lot more things become available. So I see a very practical aspect to this. But there is also games, which you know a lot of people like to spend some time playing games. And there's actually a lot of free software games available. And so we really want to enable people to take advantage of that. So there are a couple things you can now do with the improved 3D support in Fedora 13. I'll demo this game Tremulous, which is in the Fedora package repositories. So I'll start the game. I have to create a server. OK, so the game, uh, the game's loaded. I will choose to become an alien. And I will join the game. And you can see here now that the game looks very smooth and fast. And this is the kind of very advanced 3D graphics that you'll now be able to see in Fedora 13 because of the work that has gone on on the hardware drivers. The last component of this is being able to see animated workspace switches or transitions in the desktop. Um, so for example, if an application isn't responding, you might see it fade to gray now, whereas before we didn't really have a way to, to do that kind of effect on a window. So now in Fedora, if you're using the free software drivers, you get a better experience because you can see the animated transitions on your workspaces or the windows fade, but you can also at the same time be seeing a visualization like that space shuttle or whatever it is you, that you're doing. The video drivers, as I talked about, enable a lot of features and there are some very uh, practical things. But we've been working on a new uh, user interface called GNOME Shell, which is like a radically revamped desktop interface. Um, we've been able to solve a lot of problems with it. And uh, it includes a lot of animations. And we're trying to, we're trying to go for both make it look cool, very, we're trying to make it look very appealing, and the 3D enables us to do that. Um, and also to fix some of the, the problems in the desktop. So we've come very far, and you can really see that we've enabled a lot of features that just were not possible before. And now, with Fedora 13, if you install it out of the box, you can jump in and see the future and help contribute to it. <laughs> <laughs>